welcome to La Cocina de Letio. Thank you again for being here with me today. And I wanted to share with you guys a delicious recipe that has been going around and around in my families, especially when we do our tacos, or we do tostadas, or we do enchiladas, or we do sopes, or we do anything. This is habanero sauce, habanero. This is only for people who like spicy food, again. Habanero is a chili, very spicy, but we Mexicans, we love the chili, we love the spicy food. So if you like this spicy food, this is for you. This recipe is for you because it's delicious and it has a lot of onions, it has lemon. Oh my God, this is mwah, so good at any dish, especially if it's Mexican dish, it's perfect. With your tacos, with anything you want to join this habanero sauce. So don't go nowhere because I'll be back with all the ingredients that you need for this recipe. Well, my friends, I have all the, all, all the ingredients that we're gonna need for this recipe. Of course, for this salsa habanera, we need these habanero chiles. Like I said, if you don't like a lot of very spicy, then this salsa is not for you, or you can just try it with only one habanero and the whole uh, ingredients together, okay? But I have here uh, four habaneros, and I have a half a spoon of oregano, one, one tablespoon of salt and one large white onion. And we're gonna use four, you can use four to five lemons, one orange that I cut it in half so I can, I can uh, you know, take all the juice, a little bit of all cilantro, and of course some pepper. And, but this is all the ingredients that we need for this recipe. My friends, I'm gonna start cutting like that, my onions. This is the way I want it. You can um, you can do it your own way, but this is this is how I like it. This is how I like it, like that, like this. The whole thing, and we're gonna start putting back. I don't like it very thin, so I I put it a little bit, you know, like a medium size thick. But it's uh, if you like it, you really like a lot of onions. Well, you can do it your own way. But this is, this is how we're gonna do it, okay? And we're gonna add it in my bowl here. I'm gonna add all my onions in there. And as soon as I'm done, I'll be back with you to show you what is next, okay? My friend, this is the way I do my chilies. Uh, be careful with your hands because this chili habanero is very spicy. And uh, if you touch it with your fingers, your nails, I um, mean, your hands is gonna burn. So this is how I like it and how I do it myself. You touch your eyes with this, my friends, and let me tell you, it's gonna hurt, it's gonna burn. So I like to do it in small pieces, like as you can see it, like this and all my chilies is gonna go up in my bowl. And I'll be back with you when I finish to do all my chilies, okay? I'll be back. My friends, we cut in the cilantro in small pieces like this. Like that. I, don't, I like it in small pieces. So, but it's, uh, if you like to do it in a big pieces, it's up to you. 
but we're gonna add it in my ball. As you can see, I already have the habaneros in there. So, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna put the, we're gonna start putting the, the orange in here. I already took all the seeds, okay? Put all the, the, the orange in there. Oh my God, this is gonna be so good. You have no idea. These are together. My friends, we're gonna start adding the lemon. And this is gonna cook in lemon. All the onions and everything, all the habanero is gonna start cooking in lemon, okay? We're gonna do this. We're gonna put all the whole four lemons. And I'll be back with you, so let you know what else we're gonna add in here. But basically right now, this is all the lemons. And then uh, we're gonna put the uh, we're gonna put the oregano, the salt, and some pepper, and we're gonna leave it all on, my friends. Ooh, this is so good. I'll be back. My friends, this is a. Uh, I already put the salt and I already put the pepper and the oregano too. Oh, I forgot the pepper. I'm sorry. I almost forgot the pepper. I'm gonna put a little bit um, of pepper. Just a little bit for the taste. And it should be ready. And like I said, um, in Mexico and many places, when you go buy tacos, uh, tostadas, sopes, and you ask for some uh, uh, some of this onion or salsa banero, this is the kind of salsa they give you for some of the tacos. So it's in different places, they call different. But as you see, let me show you this. See this juice here? See all this juice? That's the one that's gonna, it's gonna cook all the onions and all the habaneros too. And you have to uh, be sure when you're doing this, uh, just taste a little bit and check the salt. Mmm. Oh my God, it's so delicious. I'll be back with you to show you how I'm gonna eat this delicious uh, salsa habanera. Look at this, my friend. I'm gonna show you two different options that you can use. Remember, you can use it with carne asada, with tacos al pastor, you can use uh, with the sopes, you can use any way you can use this delicious onion habanero salsa. So let me show you, for example, my granddaughter wants two tacos. This is a huge corn tortillas, look at this. And I have some refried beans here. And she wants, I have this recipe that I'm making right now for, look at this. And uh, um, I have my, uh, um, my habanero um, here. 
Ooh, my onions. Look at this, my friends. Ooh, la, la. We're gonna put it like this. She wants two tacos. So I'm gonna go ahead and do her tacos like this. Oh my goodness, look at this, my friends. You can even use, do a tostadas, but you can do it whatever you want. We're gonna put some, some cheese in the top, some cheese in the top, and this is one option how you can eat the tacos. Look at this delicious tacos, my friends. Look at this. How do you like it? You like this option? Mm. Remember, if you like my recipe, please give me a like and don't forget to subscribe. Please give me a subscribe if you like my recipes. Here's the tacos. I hope she can see it good. And let me show you the second option. Oh my friend, I don't know what to choose. The tacos, the tostadas, but they both so delicious. Let me tell you that, mmm, 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 what do you see here? Mmm, 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 they're delicious. My friend, if you like it, please subscribe to my channel. And I hope, it, I don't see, if you do the same same steps by steps like me, I don't see why you're not gonna get the same taste as mine. It's delicious, use it with tostadas, sopes, enchiladas, anything you want, my friend, and I'm pretty sure you're gonna love it. I see you next time, and subscribe to my channel. Bye-bye.